if you still prefer to print via USB, you can still uh, do so straight from Simplify 3D. Uh, you'll need to have your Gigabot turned on and plugged in to your computer. And Simplify 3D can automatically detect your printer and connect to it, but if it hasn't done so, or you'd like to check, you can click the gear icon on the right, or go to Tools, and click on Machine Control Panel. Now you're going to see the connection options under Initialization, this area right here. And you can click on the uh, red Connect button to establish the connection, and it should turn green. I'm going to plug in my Gigabot. It's going to automatically establish connection. <clears throat> you can click this again to disconnect it. For now, obviously, we need to leave it connected. Once your G-code is prepared, you can start your print from the preview mode. So I'm going to close the machine control panel. At the bottom left of the window, simply click on Begin Printing over USB, and your print uh, will automatically start in the background. It's going to give you notifications at the bottom right. And you can check the status of your print by opening your machine control panel again. You can also upload previously made G-code and print using the machine control panel. The G-Code Library tab shows G-Code files that were made in the past. If they were saved locally on your computer, it will be displayed on this window and you can select the file and run it. If your G-Code was saved to an external location like an SD card and then removed, the machine control panel will list it with a red warning icon as shown. So what I need to do is click on this file and just hit on Run Selected G-Code. It's going to print it the same as before. 